Another cool thing that Bootstrap JS allows you to do is include tooltips really simply. So let's just click on tooltip over here. And when we scroll down, we'll hover over this and these tooltips appear without having to click or anything. So we can just click on copy here, just like we did for the tab and the modal. We'll go back to Sublime Text. We're going to get rid of our HTML markup here and then we'll tab it out. We're going to save it, go back to our page, refresh, hover over, but it's not working. Now the one on the top isn't going to show, the one on the left isn't going to show either because they're both off the page, but on the bottom, they're not showing on the bottom or on the right. And by the way, that tooltip on right and tooltip on bottom, that is not the tooltip we're looking for. The reason it's not showing is because it has opt-in functionality, which means we actually need to include a little bit of JavaScript in here. So we're just going to copy this, go here, and we're going to go to the very bottom. We're going to write up these script tags. And then right in between the script tags, that's where we're going to paste this. And then we're just going to save it. When we go back and refresh, now it's working. Again, these two will not show up because they are off the screen. So be careful when you are including Bootstrap JavaScript functionality in there. Some things like tooltips, popovers, they also have opt-in functionality. So make sure that you read this really carefully.